Game of the Week presented by Adidas. Tonight we are at the Home Depot Center in Carson, California. It's a battle of number one teams, the LA Galaxy, getting set to take on the New York Red Bulls. Serena in that 4-4-2 is going to start with Donovan Ricketts, the rock and goal. Gonzalez and De La Garza, the two teammates from University of Maryland holding down that four. Central midfield, Beckham is going to come in there and share that space with Janino tonight. And the former New York Red Bull, Juan Pablo on hell up top with Chad Barrett looking to get on the score sheet. For New York, runs into the Home Depot Center. Coming off of three shutouts in a row, Buna Kandal is going to hold down that fort right there in goal. Tim Reem, Marquez, centrally is doing very well. Good partnership. Manny Bellucci, the one change, though. Timo Tanio is injured. He will take that place. And Dwayne DiRosario will be attacking midfielder tonight up front. What a great pairing these two have been. Thierry Henry and Luke Rogers looking to link up again tonight for the Red Bulls. Galaxy in the white, the New York Red Bulls. The darker blue, LA 4-2 and 3. Number one in the West, New York 4-1 and 2. Number one in the East. And this just may be the most expensive game in MLS history. And we are underway here at the Home Depot Center. Rafa Marquez knocking that one over the halfway line. Beckham's first touch is a good one to Sean Franklin. Bellucci has a big night in store for him. In place of the Finn, Tamu Tanio, who has been a very big focal point in the central midfield for New York. Angel, first touch. Bellucci will knock it back to Tim Reed. L.A. coming off a 2-1 loss to FC Dallas, while New York got a 1-0 win over Sporting Kansas City. Luke Rogers tackled away by Gonzalez. And Gonzalez is going to have his hands full. He and A.J. De La Garza have really got to keep an eye on Luke Rogers. He makes great runs into the corners. Does a lot of hard work for Thierry Henry, but he's a good compliment up front. Here is Bellucci now. New York, such a wonderful possession team. They love to control the game through their possession. Right in the upper echelon of teams in Major League Soccer when it comes to holding the ball, right, John? Absolutely. But what you're seeing already, too, though, Glenn, is the respect they're getting from the LA Galaxy. They're dropped off. They're getting numbers back behind the ball, not overcommitting. The possession's been very good. Hansbach has organized this side and done well. Like you said before, it's going to be a huge test for Manny Bellucci in there. Will he sit and be more defensive behind Di Rosario? Rafa Marquez, as he gives that one away, clearly, though, is a guy that can direct the team as a central defender. We have not seen that uh, since the likes of Lugos Kubik in Chicago. Well, he's very calm and uh, under pressure. You know, that's the thing, though. If you step up the pressure, remember, too, when he was at Barcelona, Carlos Poyol used to cover very well for him when... He was sitting next to him as a center back, so it'll be interesting to see if L.A. really pressed the ball here tonight at home. Yeah, will they put pressure on Rafa Marquez tonight when he tries to initiate the New York attack from a deep position? Here's Mike McGee now. Miller knocks it towards the halfway line. Miller Garza stepped up, and here's Luke Rogers. Won't get there. What a night it is. So many stars on the field, and... Hans Bach has done a wonderful job of orchestrating uh, the revival of the New York Red Bulls starting last year, 19-10-8. He is a Swede. He's been an assistant to Sven Jorn Eriksson. Kind of carved out his uh, dossier when he was the head coach at FC Copenhagen, winning a number of titles in Denmark. Landon Donovan with a good ball wide here. Adel is pulled out on the left. McGee chased by Dane Richards. Beckham. Oh, what a ball here. He's trying to seek out Landon Donovan. Picked it out of the air, but right at Buda Kondul. Strike the first blow to the LA Galaxy tonight. A beautifully measured pass. What a valuable asset he is, David Beckham, and his distribution is key. The, the run off the ball in behind by Landon. The timing is excellent. He gets a good touch on it, but it's directly at Kondul. Easy save for him. A routine save, but still, that's the threat that he provides when he goes and finds the game plan for the central midfield position. Dane Richards now, the Jamaican, pushes it into the box. Here's Henry. He's landed Richardson and scored. Terry Henry, the New York Red Bulls, only four minutes in. And they have struck the first blow here at the Home Depot Center. Let me 
mentioned before, Glenn, about dominating the possession and then scoring goals early. And Thierry Henry has certainly answered the critics out there. In the last three games, he's come to life. I don't think this ball was actually played for him, but he was very, very fortunate to continue his run into the 18. The lack of defending, the understanding there. Dave Richards trying to pick a ball out here. The Di Rosario, I think. But what a great finish. Calm, cool, and collective. He turns on him. Sean Franklin tried to cover very late in emergency defending. Opening goal early. This is what the Red Bulls have been doing lately. Two goals against San Jose weeks ago in the first 12 minutes of the game. Sexton dictates that tone. What a great goal. Fourth goal for Thierry Henry after the scissor-like run. And New York is up 1-0. But here comes Todd Donovan. Donovan put a ball to a hard save for the cold duel somehow. I don't know what body part he threw at it, but it was effective. On Hell trying to produce more against his former team. Well, it's the best way to answer back, isn't it, Glenn? Really, the L.A. straight up the field. Good ball by Donovan. Everybody back to defend for New York, including Thierry Henry, who's at the near post. Tons of movement in front of Cole Duel. On Hell and Gonzalez was there. Barrett got the save and somehow pulled into his chest by Buda Kondul on the shot from Chad Barrett. Kondul does very well to get to the ground low and quick. It's through traffic. That was a great save. Here it is again, set up by Landon Donovan back to Barrett. He looks to place this one, but I think at that point you've got to do power. Strike that with power. He got off his line, made himself big. Barrett could hit nothing. But the goalkeeper, Buda Kondul, and it may lead to a counterattack now. Dane Richards on the run with Henri in the middle. Richards, a left wide, save Ricketts. Henri was going to try and score. And it's blocked away by Omar Gonzalez. 16 minutes in, a corner to the New York Red Bulls. And Thierry Henry thought he could have gotten the score. She was asking for the ball from Dane Richards. Great explosive run through the midfield here. Richards says, why not? A slight deflection there. Ricketts gets his hand on it. Oh, Donovan. is up. It won't count. Boy, does Juan Pablo on hell need a goal. You see Landon Donovan. He goes wide and he collects his ball, comes back on his left, and as he does on hell, it's a good call by the assistant referee. He's just in behind Tim Ream. Good call by the assistant referee. The timing was almost there. Looking to connect to Juan Pablo on hell. And how much would he love to score against his former team where he did so much scoring for them over the years. 35-year-old Juan Pablo Angel only has uh, one goal tonight in his sixth start in New York. He had 58 goals in four seasons. Let's not forget uh, his first two years here. Those uh, weren't exceptional teams either. Beckham. Like he's got eyes in the back of his head. He picks out Mike McGee. A pass through the ball, he is. Donovan. Beckham again, uh, as you mentioned before, John, coming deep to playmake and hit these longer balls. Top of the box! What a chance for Landon Donovan, and he blew it wide. What an excellent ball that was again. And that's what I was just talking about, that battle in midfield. Beckham is dropping off. He is getting space, providing great service there. What an excellent nod down. There it is. The diagonal, it gets in behind him. Great header from Henry. He's got Dave Rosario. Dave Rosario now. Rodgers. Gets it moving. Into the box it comes. It just goes across the face of Donovan Ricketts. I'm what an attack from the New York Red Bulls. Uh, I'm sorry, Glenn. I'm not sure what Di Rosario stopped his run for. I mean, it was an excellent first touch by Joel Limpere. He almost takes it. Look at a touch here from Henri in the link up. Di Rosario has been a little bit quiet tonight, but he looks to get it on the back end of this one. Continue your run. That's an excellent ball right across the goal. That's that teasing area. Very difficult for goalkeepers and also defenders. Right in between. He's got to attack that ball and put it in. Boy, what a magnificent... Uh... Little flick from Thierry Henry that just opened everything up. Well, the confidence is high for Henry. Early on in the season, he was getting criticized for not being sharp, not being on his game, not being hungry. Well, he's answered that in the last four games for them. He's scoring goals. He's linking up. He looks fit. He wants to be involved. Had an Achilles problem, but I think 
in fairness, it's great to see healthy pressure from fans, media, yeah. uh, holding holding these superstars to the fire. Yeah, hold them accountable. You're going to be paid lots of money to come over here. It's not a picnic. Don't come over to retire. Come over here and play. You've got to produce and uh, week in and week out. It's a tough league, MLS. That healthy pressure, I think, is a, a tremendous sign of uh, the sports growth in this country. Good pair. Big tackle from Franklin, but it's Roy Miller now. Miller has spent the majority of this first half on the defensive side of things. But we know he has the ability to get into the attack. Go duel. Great header from Gonzalez who knocked it all the way forward to the feet of Angel. Zanbri again continuing to find speed and look at this juggling exhibition from Thierry Henry runs with it about five touches in the air and uh, you hear the oohs and ahs here at the Home Depot Center it's showtime are you not entertained Richards it's blocked De La Garza got in front of another ball and it would be a free kick to the LA Galaxy not as if he, he actually went anywhere, but it's good to see what kind of quality he has on the ball. But lately, he's been marked up a little bit tighter by Soli. Look at this. Henri's trying to get there, and Gonzalez had to go to ground, but New York has won the ball back in a good position here. Limper. Henri back to Limper, and he's into the box. This is dangerous. Joel Limper shot to save Ricketts. He parried it out to the 18. Beckham collects it. Well, New York almost got a second. Here's LA's chance to tie it up on the stroke of halftime. Beckham gets it into the box. Of Hull, and they score. Getting up high is Landon Donovan. Game on. It's an excellent, excellent delivery by Beckham. We talked about the accuracy when he picks out Landon Donovan. Great header and a good finish, and that's the answer you were looking for, Glenn. You just said, do they have enough time to come back? Unmarked, not even challenged. Roy Miller, who's the closest one to him? Straight up in the air. Good finish. Great timing for L.A. Five minutes before the half. He was talking smack to Henri after he scored, and now they're shaking hands saying, all right, calm down. Hey, I love it. Well, the emotions are high, Glenn. Line. Yeah, the emotions are high tonight. As they should be. Hey, in some ways, criminal, though. Nobody even goes up with Landon Donovan. Nobody leaning in. Absolutely. That's just poor defending right there. A lack of concentration defensively from the Red Bulls. Exploited by L.A. That is a monster goal psychologically. And the shutout streak is over for the Red Bulls. Coming into this game, they had not been scored upon in 292 minutes. Here's more from Beckham. They can get another here. Franklin. Donovan. He'll swing it in. Headed out by Marquez. Beckham, incredible control. And an equally good ball to Donovan. He goes down in the box. Pushed by Roy Miller. Janino has won it back. Richards being overlapped by Soli now. He has Limpair. Well, New York uh, interchanges positions so much here, John. You find the, the New York midfielders interchanging positions all over the place they are quite well and uh, the thing is though the game's getting stretched out and a bit sloppy oh it is Paul. donovan donovan donovan's got an empty net can he get it there donovan cleared by reed he didn't put enough pace on it tim reed made a huge play barrett shot save cold door unbelievable drama here in the final minutes of the first half with well, the ball that gets played through, David Beckham 
He's unchallenged in the midfield. Look at that run from Landon. He gets around Kondul. Outside of the boot, does he put enough on it? Is it over the line? Saved by Tim Ream. He just gets there. Wow, that's great effort. Way to follow through as a defender. The young U.S. international. New York uh, squeezed in and won it back through limp there. Here's Miller. But right now, L.A. is pinning the New York Red Bulls in their half of the field. They picked up where they left off in the first half. Becker. What a ball for Becker! Diagonal run from Angel. David Beckham is uh, hitting these precise balls here tonight that are, are just a wonder to the eyes. Uh, it's, it's, it's excellent display of just the, the commitment for him to pick up and see that vision, you know. It, it's excellent. What a great ball. Look at the weight of the pass again. It's so much accuracy. Henri. Donovan pressing him. These two have been going at it all night long. And Henri shook off a tackle from Donovan. Henri towards Dane Richards. And what a tackle. Mike McGee looked as though he was not a favorite to make that play. But he recovered so well with the speed of Dane Richards. I think Mike McGee he knows him well. Great defending. Excellent timing of the of the tackle. Beckham also scored against Argentina and then scored that uh, on Riesque goal against DC United. Where he flipped it up to himself and lashed a volley. In. That was the fourth goal that night. Barrett gets a crossover on Hell. He headed it right at Buna Kondul. And that's better from Chad Barrett. He's working hard down the wings and he went from middle outside and it's an excellent ball across to Juan Pablo on Hell. From close range, you think Angel's going to finish from there. It's about seven yards out. Kondul all over it. It's a good clean header. Um, that was a strange game. <laughs> Delayed for over an hour. De Rosario now has found space here on the left side. Franklin in pursuit. Still De Rosario. Still De Rosario. Close to Cole Perkins. Pass Donovan Ricketts after a one-man show. That well, was a great pace that he showed and the commitment for the run. Marquez tried this from here. Let's see. Nope, he's going to clip it into the box. Henri pounds a header wide. Or make that Agadello. My apologies. Agadello got up, snapped it with power. A good deception, though, from Marquez. He looked like he was shaping up to take a striker goal. And that slight little chip. De La Garza just losing his man, and Agadello, he, we've seen him put the ball in the back of the net. Quick, got a turn of speed. And this is Beckham territory. He will try it. Beckham, safe pull duel. At a full stretch. This is his territory. We've seen it so many times, the accuracy. Look at that. He's just placed that in the corner. A little bit more pace on that, but Buda Kondul does well to get across. It's a good save. Danger of Beckham uh, showing up in different areas, John. I think centrally he's done well. Big run here from Soli. Top of the box is Richards. Richards right footed. Shot off the post. Dave Richards hit the post. And just a few moments ago through traffic, and that's what makes it very difficult for Donovan Ricketts. But Dane Richards, he struck that well. Oh, bad giveaway here. Trouble. Beckham. He's got Burchill on the right side here. Chris Burchill. Lopez. And it's called for a foul on De Rosario. Uncharacteristic uh, sloppy play out of the back for Marquez in New York. Yeah, but I can tell you right now what Marquez was trying to do across the grain there. He was trying to pin that ball to Joel Limper. And uh, Matty Bellucci just misread it and got in the way and thought it was for him. He wouldn't ping a ball at your, <laughs> your chest there. That close range, he was trying to find Limper to open up the game. But again, when when L.A. did get that break and the, and the speed of play to go and counterattack, it's got to be a better ball, though, from Chris Burchill, the number eight. He comes in as a sub. He's got good legs, but a little bit more patience in the final third, I think. That'll do it. A share of the spoils here on an entertaining night of soccer at the Home Depot Center. Fourth minute goal from Thierry Henry. David Beckham very evident in this one tonight. Landon Donovan in the 41st for the LA Galaxy.
and it ends 1-1.